What's up, everybody? This is Russ, and my CBCS submissions just got back, and we're about to open it up and see what kind of grades we got. Hang on. All right, everybody, this is Russ with Collect What? That's right. And today, my CBCS books are back. Uh, I had sent off four books, and they just got back late last night. So I have got them here, and we're about to open them up and see what I got. Uh, now, I sent off some books that I had had for a while. I really wasn't expecting no 9.8s on anything that I had. I had some nice mid-grade and some nice uh, maybe near mint, very fine near mint, that kind of range that I sent off. Let me let me tell you the comics I sent off, and I'm going to post their pictures uh, right here. I, I sent off a Wolverine number one original series, his first miniseries. I sent off a Gargoyles number one, which is a very collectible collectible item people really like that gargoyles the animated series then i sent off a tomb of dracula with blade and dr sun in it and it's a really nice uh comic that i picked up and then the last one that i picked up is a comic that was bought for me by my father in 1980 six when it came out the original dark knight number one now i you know being young at the time when i got it i read it and i did get some bins on the back of it the front is it's beautiful but the back has some some marks on it so i wasn't expecting you know i'm hoping i'm hoping for at least maybe an eight you know so but we'll go from there so um, my comic open this up or here so I don't have to make you listen to all that ripping let's take in uh, get in here and ah yeah trusty box cutter you know I've only used CBCS one other time and when I use them I only use them for one book so it is packed very well. A lot of wrapping, a lot of uh, bubble wrap, and like a, uh, invoice in there with them. I don't want to see the grade, so all right, this is the back. I know this is the back. Okay. Okay. All right, box cutter. With your magic. And this is exciting. Kind of nervous. Hoping to get some nice ones. But, you know, like I said, they're older books. They're older books, so. Except for the gargoyles. I think it was in the 90s. Everything else is from what? The 70s and 80s? Okay, okay, so I have my invoice here. I have my invoice and I have a little card here and comic link. I have my invoice and it's, um, I've said that about five times. Okay, all right. So I have... All of these, I don't know which one is first, so we're going to start from the back forward and go from there. All right, my first one that I have here is my Dark Knight. Yeah, I'm going to try and cover up the gray. All right, I have a Dark Knight, Batman the Dark Knight. Turns number one. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I have some marks here on the back and the spine. 
that's the only thing. Let's see right here. Yeah, the grader's notes. It says just go to CBCS. So let's see what it says here on the front. First appearance of Carrie Kelly. Father becomes uh, later becomes Robin. Joker appearance, Two Face Origin. Huh. All right, and the grade is an 8.5. Okay, 8.5. I was kind of prepared for that. Oh, that's actually a little bit better than what I was thinking. Hmm. Wow. Well, that is. That's better than what I was thinking. That it was. Wow. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. I hated that the back was just messed up on it. So, got it there. It looks good. Got 8.5. Oh, God. That, oh, well. Can't all be 9.8. Now, I have one here. I think this is Gargoyles. Is it Gargoyles? Yes, it is. Gargoyles, number one. Based on the animated series, embossed cover. This is the direct edition. It looks really, really good. I wish that they had Grader's Notes on here. So I could see what they say on it. Maybe I could just pay for it later on. Let's see what we got. 9.4. All right, that's cool. That's good. That's good. That's exactly in the range that I was hoping for. That's a 9.4. Wow. Look at that. that looks really good. Yeah, I see like one, two, one little, two little spine ticks and all like that. Yeah, check it out. The graders notes on online. But I'm happy with it so far. Their cases feel good. These are their new cases. And they feel really good. I can't fuss about that. They feel kind of like more in line with CGCs. I like the way they feel, so that's good. All right, now we're going to our Tomb of Dracula, Lord of Vampires. Now, I bought this. I actually got this comic from Stevie B when he sent out his mystery boxes, and I got this, and I really liked it, and I said, you know what? Let me take and send this off because it was in really good shape. And I said, you know, I, really, I think by the time you averaged out the price of his boxes, I only paid like three seventy for this comic and grade it. It could be up to a hundred or four hundred dollars they want it for. It. So I said, it's in really good shape. Let me send it off. Nine point zero. All right. All right, white pages, blade appearance. Yeah, and I forgot, I didn't look at the others. Yeah, white pages and white pages. Everything's got white pages. <clears throat> okay. And now, last one, Wolverine number one. Now, this is the one that did have some spine ticks on it, and it did have some... Um, you know, just like little creases here and there all on it. I did pay to have it pressed, so I would have thought that that would have helped. So I'm not expecting more than maybe probably a seven. I'm seven, so let's see what we got. All right, 7.5. That's not bad. That's not bad, it's better than I thought. And it's off-white to white pages. This is the new stand edition. It's first Wolverine in his own title. First pair of Yoko, Yukio, and Cameo, and Makira Hashida, and the hand appearance. Yeah, that's really sweet. And now's the time to go ahead and get them graded before he's introduced to the MCU. So yeah. So I don't feel too bad about these. Um, I do think that I found one mistake. 
I don't know, but you know it happens. They've got this listed as my Dark Knight. They have it listed as a third printing. This was a first printing that I bought. Um, and I know it was, or my father bought it for me, and I know it was a first printing. So I'm going to have to contact them about that and see if maybe there was something that I missed somehow. Or, I don't know, because I know for a fact that it was a first printing. I even looked at it, and I had, I mean, yeah, I just don't know. So I'm going to have to check that out. But besides that, everything's kind of in line with exactly what I wanted, and it looks good. I'm happy with it. This is my first time using CG, or CBCS in bulk, you know, more than one comic at a time. So I'm really impressed with their holders. They feel really good. The presentation is really good. Yeah, I mean, the, the cases feel really, really nice because they said that they had just changed them fingerprints on the inside of it but I guess we'll live with that you know but yeah the cases are really phenomenal I like how it's listed on top so all right that sounds good all right well I guess I'm gonna wrap up with the exception now let me also mentioned with the exception of this Dark Knight issue which I'm going to keep just for sentimental reasons everything will be listed on my eBay page so if you're interested in making part of my collection part of your collection let me know we can always work out something in the meantime please go down there and hit that like button hit the subscribe button Hit the little bell that tells you when I'm on YouTube. And please share this video with your friends and family. Let them know I'm out here. I'm still right around that 150 mark. Okay? So, please. Yeah, I don't know. And you know, I, I'm going to mention this. I don't know if there's something wrong with my videos. Or nobody's getting the notification that they're being listed. But like my last video in two weeks has got five views do i suck that bad if i suck that bad please tell me in the comments because i mean tell me what i can do different okay tell me something to help me out so in the meantime please take care of yourself take care of each other and keep collecting